The sport of the future isn't about jogging or your local gym, it's about how technology will rewrite the very concept of the human body. Even today, neurosensors track reactions, VR simulators boost focus, and AI algorithms design training plans better than any coach. In the future, champions won't be born, they'll be engineered. Back in 2019, Chinese scientists edited mouse genes, so the animals could run almost twice as fast as normal. That's a direct teaser for genetic doping. Icelandic company Osur develops bionic prosthetics that connect directly to the nervous system. In 2023, athletes tested them. And yes, they can actually outperform natural legs. In 2021, the World Anti-Doping Agency added gene and cell therapies to its banned list. Why? Because it's no longer sci-fi. It's a real threat to fair play. So forget the old Olympic motto, faster, higher, stronger. The future of sports isn't just about records, it's about a new biology of the human body. Exoskeletons, neural interfaces, and smart prosthetics are already here, giving athletes an edge over the natural body. And the question is, will it still be called sport when the Olympic stage is filled with biohackers, implants, and muscle replacements? Sports organizations are already debating the rules for these cyber athletes. Because in 20 years, a doping test will look like child's play, when your opponent's fatigue isn't in his muscles, but in his built-in battery. Like and follow, so you don't get stuck in the past. Here's your future. I explain it in simple words. Yours, Pixel Blonde.